Hey Aquarius, Empress 777 here today with the general love reading for the first half of January, guys. Happy New Year. Okay, let's get into this reading. It's general. It's going to be for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. It's general. Can't be for every Aquarius, but take what resonates and leave the rest. Put yourself where you belong in the story. All right, cross watchers are welcome. This is geared towards messages from your person, what's on their mind, what they may be hiding, um, all that good stuff, okay? So let's take a look. Hope you guys are doing well. These are super hard to shuffle, but we're going to get it together. <laughs> we going to get it together. Let me see. Yeah, they're hard to shuffle. All right. Holy angels and spirit, guys. What we got? I will fix it. Okay, somebody is determined. You may not even be paying any attention to this person. You may have walked all the way away. Told them there's no possibility of reconciliation, but they are determined. They want to fix it. They messed it up, so they want to fix it. They could have broken this relationship or this connection. Um, all right. They can't see not being with you, though. Oh, yeah. So divine connection could be dealing with a soulmate here, guys, or twin flame. Um, somebody who possibly didn't even know just how strong this connection was until the until the the threat of it actually being gone was presented to them. OK, we have shadow self. Yeah. So this person is vibrating much lower than you. OK, this is how they messed it up. They're in their toxic energy. Wow. They may have brought that toxicity to the relationship. Now they want to fix it. They have to fix themselves, though, first. That should say, I will fix myself. But we're going to see. <laughs> I'm just saying. You can't fix a relationship if the problem is you. If it's you, you have to fix you. Let's see. I could never find another you. Right person, wrong time. Yeah, so... This is a divinely guided soulmate. This could definitely be twin flame, guys. I get twin flame vibes all over this. With that shadow self, you may be the twin that is vibrating much higher than this person. Um, if it's not a twin flame, of course, it could just be a really strong uh, soulmate connection. All right. Um, you guys are divine counterparts. You may have saw great potential with this person and then they just came and effed it up. That's what I hear. That's what I hear. All right. Let's see right person wrong time so they this person was not ready for you they weren't expecting to meet their soulmate when you guys met when you started dating they weren't expecting that yeah they they weren't expecting it we have the page of pentacles so this is the offer that they were coming towards you with which is pretty much nothing it's empty it's an empty offer this is someone that you were dealing with that was pretty immature their conversation may have been immature their energy may have been immature um we have the Ten of Swords in the reverse. So I do feel like they want to fix it, guys. They do. They want to heal this. This person may have broken your trust, okay? Whatever it is that they did, they broke your trust. They do know that you're their soulmate, but because they are not vibrating very high at all, they had no choice but to sabotage this. That was the only outcome with someone who um, is operating from their shadow side, okay? Um, they have to go in and fix this for things to work. Yeah, so we have the Knight of Swords. That's over the Divinely Guided Connection. So this is someone who potentially was all about moving forward when it came to the physical portion of the relationship. They may be someone who don't take accountability. Yeah, we have the Three of Swords as well. This is someone who... Um, they just kind of run off at the mouth. They're saying a whole bunch of nothing. You know what I mean? Um, they do know that you're their soulmate, but they presented themselves as someone. Yeah, I got it. Like, I, let's just go with the flow. Um, they wanted to keep their options open. They kind of just wanted to give these little immature, smaller offers to you. And they definitely expected you to accept that, but you didn't. Um, they, this person broke your heart. They broke your heart. They did. I do feel like there, there was third party energy going on here. I definitely feel that, especially with the Knight of Cups. This is Rico Suave. Okay, this is someone who um, entertains and uh, romances many. All right, they are now realizing the error of their ways. 
This is somebody who is a bit, they have a bit of a player-like energy, okay? Page of Pentacles is such a small offer. Um, this is very surface level. There is no higher level of commitment in this offer. The communication lacks any sort of substance. Couldn't get this person to have an in-depth conversation with you, especially not about a relationship or a higher level of, um, of commitment. So overshadow self. Yeah, this person is stuck in this energy, though. This is somebody who's been operating this way for many of years, guys. It's not just you. They treat everybody like this, but you're the divinely guided soulmate. You're the twin flame. You're their, you're their person. So they have to learn this lesson before you guys can come into union. This is this is why things have gone down this way. It's faded. I get the fact, I get the energy that this is a faded event. All right, you walking away is what's waking them up to this. They do feel stuck. They feel stuck in your energy and they don't normally feel that. <laughs> okay, that's what I'm hearing. Normally, it's just like on to the next, you know? They keep like a list of people that they kind of rotate in and out, in and out. But you, they can't do that with you. You're the sun. You, the, you're the highest. You're the highest that it, that it gets. Ten of those people couldn't match what you bring to them. So this is what they're looking at, okay? <sighs> I could never find another you. Yeah, they tried. <laughs> they definitely tried. And you ended that. You, you ended the cycle of being juggled. You ended the cycle of being an, you're not an option. You're the only option. If a person can't see that, then they're lost. I feel like I get that kind of energy. They are feeling this now though. This is definitely waking them up. The fact that they can't, they can't release it. They can't let go. I could never find another you. Yeah, we have the Page of Wands in the reverse. So Page of Wands in the upright is like a new spark of passion, a new spark of, of pleasure, of fun. This is what they were doing. When you disconnected, when you ended things with them, they were trying to entertain several people. They were trying to replace you. They were not able to do that. It's in the reverse now. They, they no longer want to do that. Now they want what? <laughs> Ten of Pentacles. They want to marry you. They do know that they have to fix this, though. Isn't that what came up first? I will fix it. <laughs> yeah. They do have to fix this. But what it is that they have to fix is these patterns of this player-like energy. This is just not something that you will accept at this point in time in your life. They will be met with rejection if they try to come towards you in that way. I feel like they know that. This is why they have that page of wands in the reverse. So they're no longer trying to go towards new sparks of passion. This person, this person, which person, that person. They're not doing that anymore. This person may really be working on themselves now, now guys. Okay? I'm just saying that. I'm not saying that you're going to take a back or anything like that. But I'm just saying that they now see the benefit of becoming a better person because you're the sun. There's only one sun. There's only one. There's only one sun. All right. Let's get some advice from Spirit. They're trying to fix the they're trying to fix themselves for you, uh, Aquarius. I don't know if you're down for it, you know? They hurt you. They really hurt you. They broke your trust. They're gonna have to not only work on themselves, but then they're gonna have to rebuild your trust. You know, they're gonna have to start out very small. You're not diving in head first with them. Definitely not. Healing family issues. Yeah, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. This is why they behave this way. It's something that they saw in their past in, in regards to higher levels of commitment and marriage. And they try to avoid relationships and higher levels of commitment, but it's true love. They really love you. They never expected to feel so stuck in their life. They never did because they never have before. Nobody has made them feel stuck. No, they just build another list. But they can't do that with you. Why? Because there's only one sun, period. All right, that's what I get. Let me know if this has resonated. Click that like button. Definitely click the subscribe button, okay? We'll reconvene next time.